Hey guys, welcome to my channel and hope you're doing well. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to get rid of with this annoying pop-up which comes up, which says Adobe Genuine Software Integrity Service now. The reason is if you've ever downloaded an Adobe software, which was a cracked version or a torrent file, and then after uninstalling it as well you'll bev getting these messages and it's been a recent change what Adobe has done. So guys I am going to show you a very simple way, which you can get away and you can replace this and you can remove this so I'll show you a very quick and easy way. So, how to remove this pop-up so that it doesn't annoy you anymore. It's very easy, the first thing is that. In your MacBook, you need to click on the desktop anywhere so that you can see the Apple logo finder and file as it shows over here. All you need to do, you can click over here in the Go menu and under the Go menu. You've got Go to Folder so as soon as you click Go to Folder, it'll give you an option over here now because I've done this before, so that's why it's popping up. Over. H. What you need to do is you need to go into the home sign. Slash library slash application support. So if you click over here on the application support, and that should open up a window, right? So we just move that over there and you can see that you have all your application support over. Here, you have all the applications which were installed and then removed so they do leave their folders and files in your MacBook, which probably could give you problems afterwards as in the case of Adobe. So in Adobe's case, we have a folder over here and you can see that there are so many folders inside. The Adobe folder, which if you go into them, you can see that. There's a lot of stuff what you can do so you can save your any of the work which you've done from here, anything like that we should like to save and the rest. You can just simply delete it once when you have deleted these folders. And also got rid of the Adobe folder, then you should not receive this pop-up anymore. All you need to do is click over here on the learn more. And then that should open up a browser. And then after that, you can just close that browser as well. And the pop-up would come not come up. And do don't forget to empty the bin so once you've emptied the bin it should not annoy you anymore. I hope this video helpful. Thanks for watching. Please let me know in the comment section if is it helpful.